Hi friends, I'm super excited and thrilled to be sharing this one pot dish with you. This recipe is so yummy and very convenient that it will get you eating and enjoying like I'm doing right now. I'm so excited about this one and I cannot wait for you to try out this recipe. Please tell me you would. <laughs> to my channel my name is Ada and this channel is called cooking with Ada if this is your first time here I want to welcome you to my channel and I hope you get to stick around and watch my videos to my subscribers thank you guys so much for always coming through watching my videos and sharing them friends today I want to make a very easy and quick dish I'm gonna call this one a one pot dish because I'm making everything in one pot I'll be making this dish from turkey and rice and a few other ingredients so please stick around through to the end of this video to tell me what you think about this one pot dish would you be trying out this one pot dish before we go ahead to cook let's quickly run through the ingredients that i'll be using to make this dish and so here are all the ingredients that i'll be using to make this dish the main dish is from rice i'm using this ben's original rice and i and i'm certain it's gonna turn out lovely i'll also be using turkey wings i'll be using some shrimps bell pepper tomatoes and most importantly i'll be using coconut milk so this is going to be like coconut rice but in but i'll be making everything in one pot so that's why it's called a one pot dish a coconut rice one pot one pot dish so maybe i'll tell maybe i'll name this food coconut rice 2.0 or something but this is a one pot dish and we'll see how everything turns out at the end of the day so friends do not worry about all these ingredients as we cook i will be sharing with us in details everything that i'll be putting in it so that you follow through come along let's cook <laughs> i'll start by boiling my turkey because um i'll be needing the turkey stock or the turkey broth the broth from the turkey i'll be needing it to cook so that it's important that i boil it to be able to get that broth one spoon of pepper half spoon of thyme this is paprika um, i just like that paprika flavor so i'll add that i'll also be adding black pepper i really love this flavor so i'll, I'll add a lot of it as well this is white pepper all these are natural um their spices because they're natural so i really like them they give your they will give the turkey a very unique natural flavor then this is garlic it's more like dried garlic i like to use this as well this is carota butter it's a flavor i love as well um, I have here some roast or dried onions. I like this flavor as well. So I'm going to be adding some of that. My vegetable seasoning. So if you have a um, no cube or stock cube, bouillon cube, you can use that as well. Water. Just a little bit of water. And this is also like no onion flavor. I love onions, so um, I like to use a lot of onions flavor when I cook. So I'll just um, leave this like this for a while before I stir it. So I'll just cover it up. We'll would also be using corn to make a one pot dish. So I'm just going to give our, our corn a quick rinse and I'll bring it back. So I'm done rinsing the corn and I want to cut it into three equal parts because that's how that's the size I need to cook with. Set. 
So um, the turkey has stayed boiling now, so I'll just give it a good stir. So to make our corner, I added a melted butter. I have melted butter here. Now we with with salt. Salt. Kosa butter. Just a little. Use paprika. Because I'm putting this inside the pot, so. So I'm just going to rub this on the body of the corn so that um, other flavors would be <laughs> we'll soak up in we'll, the corn will soak up all the flavor. Easy. I have a grilled corn. I'm gonna use the air fryer to grill this corn. Yep, that's it. I grilled the corn at 170 degrees for about 10 to 15 minutes on each side. Our turkey looks good now and because we are still going to be frying this turkey, I don't want to overcook it. I think I've been cooking it for about 10-15 minutes now. So I'll just go ahead to remove this turkey now. I'm going to use my holy file. Once I start frying the turkey, I did like a pepper marinade with dried pepper, salt and melted butter. Then I carefully used a pastry brush to brush the surface of my turkey with this marinade to make my turkey more spicy. If you like spice like me, like we do, we love spice. <laughs> Okay, at this point, I think the um, my turkey is okay, um, but depending on how dark you want it to be darker than this, you can just still leave it um, to fry some more. Um, I think for me it's, it's fine. Yeah, I think it's fine. But it doesn't get burnt. Well, I'll just leave it a little more and see what happens.
I'm going to let this fry for about five to ten minutes, then we'll come back to it. So this is um, the rice. So let me see. It usually comes in like something like this. So I think I'll use I used to pack two like this. So I'm gonna go wash this rice and get it ready to be used. so basically any seasoning that you like to use white pepper just feel free to use any of all of that i like to use this um, seasoning because it adds it gives the food a bright color like that reddish Jello fries color. So that's why I like to do this. This seasoning in particular. I'll give it a good stir. Some bell peppers. Go with my shrimp. If you're watching this video up until now and you're enjoying this kind of content please give this video a thumbs up and click that subscription button so that you can get a notification anytime we post a new video this encourages me to make more cooking videos for you so this is the um coconut milk i'll now do my coconut milk oh wow <laughs> it's frozen I'm now like ice cream. Yes, Israel. Mommy's cooking, Israel. Okay. Mommy's cooking. Okay. Okay, so so close the door back. Thank you, Israel. Okay. Okay, bye now. Bye. Bye, Israel. Thank you. Cheers. 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 Alright. Okay, bye. Cheers, baby. Bye. bye. Okay, so I'll allow this um, heat up a bit. So I've, I've washed my rice. I'll be going in with my rice now. So I ended up using three and not two because um, I think the two are looking too small. And I want to have this rice all through this week. <laughs> If that is even if that is even possible when oh, making yeah. a rice dish ensure to check the cooking instruction for the particular rice you are using this rice the cooking instruction is 10 minutes so ensure to check because it will be very helpful to ascertain the quantity of water that you'll be putting when cooking the and rice then then a little bit of the um turkey broth just go with a little bit of it and if the rice needs more, also here with the corn. Like I said, this is a one pot, so everything goes into it. So you can cook sweet with the rice so that the flavor will be out of this 
board. And I will cover this and let's come back to it. Okay, so this is after 10 minutes now. Um, the rice is almost soft, but not like I would want it, and it's almost ready. So, um, I'll just sprinkle some carrots. Green pepper. This is um, red kidney beans. Just then we'll cover it after two minutes. I just want to give it a, a stir because it looks ready and some part of it below is still looking like you know it's it's ready but let's just give it a, a little stir. yes friends so our rice is ready so i'll finally call this one pot coconut rice my one pot coconut rice is ready i garnished this dish with lemon slices and some green leaves i hope you enjoyed watching me make this dish please let me know what you think in the comment section so hi friends it's time for me to taste my one pot dish so i'm just gonna scoop gently yeah. i'm going to look for the smallest turkey because i don't like eating big turkey okay this looks small oh. okay move this aside so that you can see my plates This is so tasty. Very, very tasty. Mm. 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 I like the turkey as well. It's very soft. The turkey is really soft, like so soft. Mm. Just to cut. Mm. Mm. Friends, everything in this pot is wow. <laughs> so thank God the coconut rice one for dish came out amazing. So friends, we've come to the end of this video. Please like, share, and subscribe. Let me know in the comment section if you'll be trying out this recipe. And I hope you would. Let me know how yours went. So I'll see you in my next video. Cheers. Bye. <laughs>